हाँ स्टूडेंट्स नाउ लेट अस सी द ओवरव्यू ऑफ एस ई आई सी एम एम सो व्हाट इज दिस एस ई आई सी एम एम स्टैंडर्ड एस ई आई इज नथिंग बट सॉफ्टवेयर एस इज सॉफ्टवेयर ई फॉर इंजीनियरिंग इंजीनियरिंग एंड आई फॉर इंस्टीट्यूशन सो सॉफ्टवेयर इंजीनियरिंग इंस्टीट्यूशन डेवलप्ड a developed a product means a develop a standard that you call it as uh, the standard was cmm cmm means let me write that cmm means capability maturity model so if your product is having this feature the capability and the maturity then this software engineering institution uh, were going to be make your product as a cmm levels means insert your company in a cmm levels so software engineering institution developed developed cmm capability maturity model so this sci cmm helped uh, it helped organizations let me write that point software engineering institution capability maturity model helped organizations so why we are using this standards uh, is it required uh, for whatever the organization they are uh, use means whatever the organization the people are running so they are uh, required some standards to maintain uh, in a public means if you if they want they want a business benefits they have to maintain some standards they have uh, so that is sei cmm ca sei cmm help it helped organizations to improve the quality of software quality of software they develop they develop so each organization has to maintain some quality on the softwares so if they are maintaining the quality uh, whatever uh, on the softwares whatever they are developed they can be recognized by cmm that is a capability maturity model okay so the adoption of adoption of software engineering institution capability maturity model has significant has significant business benefits has a significant business benefits now let us see this cei cmm can be used in two ways so one is it can be used in two ways one is uh, i can say it is a capability evaluation capability evaluation and another was uh, this is software process assessment software process assessment assessment so sei cmm Uh, can be used in two ways. One is the cap capability evaluation, another is the software process assessment. Capability evaluation means it provides a way to access the software process capability of an organization. It just provides a way. The evaluation, the capability evaluation, is going to provide a way to access the software process. capability in an organization and what about this software process assessment how can you say uh, in which way this software process assessment can be used in uh, si cmm model so it is used so this software process assessment is used by an organization by an organization with the objective the main objective of using this software process assessment in an organization is to improve the process capability the process capability so the 
CI CMM can be used in two ways either you can go for the capability evaluation of the product uh, or the software process as assessment so based on that project and the product uh, quality they are going to give the some standards to that organization now let us see SEI CMM classifies software development industries into five maturity levels SEI CMM classifies software development industries software development industries into five maturity levels five maturity levels so what are the first five maturity levels that going to be uh, decide I mean uh, the CMM levels are going to decide that software development in industries in which level like that so the first level level one level one you call it as an initial level level one is an initial level so this initial level saying that a software development organization at this level so whatever the software organization is there so at this level means suppose it is in level one it indicates it is characterized it is characterized by ad hoc activities ad hoc activities so level one is nothing but it is an initial level so if your software development organization is an initial level means it is indicating that it is characterized by ad hoc activities my means very few or no process are defined and followed means a starting stage only few process are there and that is uh, defined and only some people are following so that indicates the cmm level first stage initial stage and next is a level two So level two, you call it as a repeatability. So if your organization is in repeatability, you are indicated with a standard of uh, CMM level two. So what is this repeatability? At this level, at this level, the basic project management, the basic project management practices such as tracking cost such as tracking cost of your project and schedule or establishment like that schedule or established tracking cost and schedule or established that will be everything will be considered if your organization is related to the uh, tracking cost and schedule basis then it will be indicated as a level 2 cmm now coming to the third one that is a level 3 level 3 you can say it is defined the organization is a defined so when you can say it is a defined at this level at this level process whatever the process you are dealing with the processes for both management both management and development activities and development activities are defined and documented means it is everything will be managed means everything will be documented so whatever the activities that we are going to be uh, taking place in your product in your process so the both management and the development activities are defined and documented means perfectly scheduled so that you can say that your organization is comes under the level 3 cmm the maturity level you have they are given will be the defined means this company organization was defined now let us see the third one fourth level level four level four you call it as a managed okay if level three is defined means uh, if organization is defined they can give the level three cmm level four is managed managed is indicating that 
at this level the focus is on software matrix the complete the focus is on software matrix they raise ups and downs of the project everything next is level 5 the last level in the cmm the level 5 is indicates the optimized optimizing if your organization is in optimizing stage then you can uh, make it as a level 5 cmm at this stage processes and product metrics are collected product metrics are collected so this is about the overview of the sei software engineering institution developed by cmm that is the capability maturity models so in the capability maturity model is nothing but it is a standard it is a which are giving to the organizations so it will uh, the standard will be given on five maturity levels the industries the software development in industries can be in this any five maturity levels level one is initial level two is repeatable level three is defined level four is managed level five is optimizing thank you